Hi, in this episode, we are going to talk about Twitter cards. If you have gone to Twitter these days, each tweet, uh, you will see something down there. It's called Twitter cards. It can give you a lot of different kind of information dep- depending on your tweet. Like the tweet which we are seeing right now is about one of the YouTube video. So it's saying view media. If I click on it, it's going to fetch me the media right there on Twitter and I can watch the video here. The same way if you see this is another tweet which is regarding one of the blog posts and if I click on view summary you can see that the whole post detail is available including your thumbnail, uh, expert and the title and you can directly click and view it on the from the Twitter itself. This is one of the good ways to promote your blog post or content at this point of time. Now what we are going to see in this video is how we can activate these kind of Twitter cards on our WordPress blogs. So Let me go to my blog and let you know how I have activated it there. The easiest way to activate Twitter cards on your blog is WordPress SEO by Yoast. This is one of the best SEO plugin. Once you install this plugin, it has a social tab. You can go on social tab and under that Twitter and just select add Twitter card metadata and put your Twitter username and you are done. As soon as you hit save settings, your site will start generating metadata which Twitter needs to show Twitter cards. If you are not using um, this plugin, the other way would be to have JM Twitter cards plugin. This plugin will give you a flexibility to generate Twitter cards. It can be installed along with the WP SEO or it can be installed separately. If you install it separately, you have to set it up uh, so you have to set it up everything in the settings here but if you install it with wp seo it will pick up all the other details like metadata your meta description meta titles from the wp seo settings so you can select what kind of cards you want here enter your twitter accounts and you can say what the seo plugins you are using and where you want to pick the data including the thumbnail and other stuff you can set it up in this plugin so once you have set up everything here and your site is ready what you can do is you can actually go to this particular url so once you have reached here it is going to ask you which kind of Twitter card you are setting up for your blog like I'm going to select summary this is one of the place where you can validate all your metadata and it will actually show you what metadata is not available so like if I go for validate and apply I will enter one of the posts from my blog and will say go it's going to revisit that URL it's going to check and here it is going to show you how your URL or your posts will look on Twitter and here on the left side it is going to show you what all Twitter cards it has found and where all it is picking the data. So if you are satisfied with the presentation which you are getting in here and all your Twitter cards looks okay you can go and submit this thing. If it, you are not okay with this, you have to actually correct something, you can go and correct that out. For me, the submit button is not coming out because my blog is already approved, which it is showing here. But if your blog is not approved, you will see the submit button and you can submit that and it's done. Twitter says within one or two weeks, you should receive an email from them, which should tell you that your blog is approved. And once that is done, your, your domain links will start showing the links 
where users can get the summary of the posts hope after this uh, video you will activate the twitter cards on your blog and will get benefit from it thank you if you like the video i would really appreciate if you can uh, like it on youtube or share it with your friends thank you